Big shout out to Sporting Icon, best channel out there. Okay, so three weeks today will be April the 29th. This is the date that Frank Warren says he's booked Wembley Stadium. This is the time when Tyson Fury will be fighting on that date with or without Alexander Usyk. Well, we're three weeks away and Fury still doesn't have an opponent. So that tells me he ain't been training. That tells me he had no intention of fighting April the 29th. So what exactly is he going to do? What's happening with the April 29th date? Was this date ever really the date for Fury Usyk? I'm not saying it wasn't. What I'm saying is, was it really? Because for Frank Warren to say that Fury is going to be fighting on that date anyway, this is the date that, that they put out there, and Fury is going to fight on that date regardless. Okay, but well where's the plan B? Was he fighting regardless? Or was he not going to be fighting at all? Was his whole thing with Alexander Usyk just a ruse? Was it just a publicity stunt to try and make out that Usyk didn't actually want the fight when we know it was Tyson Fury he did, who didn't really want the fight. He was the one putting up the road obstacles. He was the one who priced himself out. He was the one who refused to turn for a rematch in case he lost. Not my opinion, fact. He did. If he was confident that he was going to beat Usyk and there's no way that this little middleweight rabbit was going to beat him, he wouldn't have cared what the rematch terms were. But you offer this man 70-30 for the first fight, then you should be accepting him for the rematch if Usyk beats you. But you didn't, because you weren't confident you were going to win. So what's Tyson Fury doing next? What are you going to do? Have a fourth Wilder fight? You're going to call out Andy Reese Jr., a victim of Anthony Joshua? Who are you going to fight? You know, fourth fight with Derek Chisora? Who are you going to fight? You gonna fight your mate Joseph Parker? Are you gonna fight Joe Joyce, even though Joe Joyce is not ranked in the WBC? Are you gonna fight that fight? How's that gonna happen if he's not ranked in the top fifteen in the WBC? How's that gonna happen? I'm just curious. What's happening with this April 29th date? What's happening with the Wembley Stadium date? Makes me believe that Fury never had any intention of fighting. Is it because he's healing time for the surgery that he allegedly had? Took too long? Is that why? Maybe he's going to retire. Wouldn't surprise us. Maybe do us all a favour. Maybe at that point, somebody else can get hold of that WBC belt and actually defend it for undisputed. Rather than ducking and pricing themselves out. It's a shame. Fury's a phenomenal fighter. He is. But what's he doing? Is he going to go fight Francis Ngannou in a crossover fight? What's he going to do? Anybody know? Anybody have any idea what it is that he's going to do next? And will it be good enough to replace him ducking Alexander Usyk? Is he going to fight Joshua? Well, it ain't going to be April 29th, is it? Drop your thoughts below, click on the subscribe. Catch you next video.